Hello everybody, today's video is going to be some more highlights from some of our recent The Hunters Classic streams. We have some pretty awesome and interesting moments in this video, so I hope you guys enjoy. We got our first rare since my return to Classic, along with a buck that would have almost been my best without deductions. But before we start, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications because I post daily The Hunter videos and do 5 live streams a week, and if you don't subscribe you're going to be missing out on a lot of awesome content. Also be sure to join my Discord and become a part of the Scare Crew today. Keep in mind that Discord's terms state that you must be 13 or older to have an account. But with that being said, let's get straight into today's video. Oh, ooh, looky there. That's a good buck, I think. Let's get another look at him. Okay, that's a different one. So there's two bucks here, and one of them looks pretty decent. Oh, yeah, that's a good buck. That one's at least 150s. Yeah, he's a good buck. That's actually a really decent buck. If it was a little bit wider, it could be pretty high scoring, but I'd say this guy's at least 150s, probably low 160s, though. Uh, once he gets a little closer, I'll be able to get a better right. look. Nice, we got him down. Now, there's one more buck, but I don't know where he is now. I'm guessing this will be low 160s. It is an 8 point though. Yeah, this is an 8 point. It might be high 160s then. Maybe. Let's see. 160. Oh my gosh, Jaren. You nailed it. <laughs> you absolutely nailed it, my dude. Right on 163. Almost perfectly 163. That's funny. That's funny that you absolutely nailed that. Hard to get good lighting here, but I mean, it's not a huge buck, so it's alright. Not too bad. Buck of the day for sure. Well, this is our buck. That's convenient. He's literally right where we came from. He must have started coming to our call. That's nice. Uh, that's not a bad buck. I mean, he's not huge, but... He's decent. Oh, wow. This guy's bigger than I thought. That's actually a good deer right there. If he doesn't start coming towards us, then I might have to use the gun. Because I don't want this guy to get away. Definitely nice. Oh, yeah. He's good. Oh, he does have some stickers off the sides, though. That's going to hurt his score a little bit. But overall, he's a pretty even buck. I don't see a ton of deductions. Alright, what do you guys want me to do? Wait for it and take it with the bow? Or should we use the 30-30 or the 10 mil? 30-30, 30-30, pistol, rifle, gun. Alright, well, I see a lot of 30-30 in there, so let's just rip the scope off and do this the right way. Nice. Definitely satisfying to just blast things with the 30-30. This is definitely a good buck, though. I'm happy with this guy. Oh, yeah. That guy's huge, but those stickers, man. What do we got here? 178. That's not too bad. That's a good white-tailed deer. But, yeah, those stickers are everywhere. I really feel like that hurt the score. Uh, we'll have to see what it was without deductions. Nice. We'll take that. I like that one. Go ahead and sell that. That's not bad, though. 178. Go ahead and take her out. Since she's just in a chill there. Set. Oh my gosh, that's a piebald. That's a piebald. <laughs> we got a piebald, my dudes. Oh my gosh. Let's go. We got a piebald. That is awesome. Oh my gosh. 
It's only a doe, but that's still really cool. That's crazy. Juelo got the albino. And I just got a piebald on the same map. That is awesome. That's pretty insane, to be honest. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and accept that. And let's tax it. We don't have a rare in our lodge yet for whitetail, so even if it is just a female, we'll still keep it in a second. Ooh, that's not a bad bull. Let's get a better look at it. Not too bad. 255 to 425 on the estimate. That's not bad. That's a good looking bull. Art shot on a pretty big bull. Definitely happy with that. He does have some drop tines though. That might hurt it a little. But it's a good one. 345, that's not bad at all. Not too bad, we'll wait for the light to get all the way in here and there we go. Not too bad. It did have, wow, there's actually, yeah, this guy probably had quite a few deductions on it, but not too bad. Are you manhandling another animal? Of course. <laughs> what else would I be doing? Got two toms here. We'll take the close one and then the far one shouldn't be too difficult to get after. There's actually two out there. Let's spot these. Lots of turkeys today. Definitely a turkey kind of day. 7.4 to 10? That's a high estimate. Higher than what I've seen at least. Uh, what is max weight estimate, my dudes? I'm guessing 10 is. What was that? That is most certainly an elk. Okay. Oh, there's another tom. Where did you come from, sir? We're most definitely spooking at least one of these. That looks even more decent looking, though. Yeah, we're going to take that guy, I think. Can we maybe get this? Oof, we did it. We did it. <laughs> we didn't spook off the other ones. I'm kind of surprised, but we did it. That's so cool, man. All the wild needs that. I don't know why it doesn't have it. We did it. We somehow got all of these. <gasps> Good thing they don't spook from that. And we got another turkey out there by that elk. Well, let's start claiming these. 64. That's a good turkey. <laughs> That's not a bad turkey at all. That might be my personal best. Good enough. Good enough. Nice. I love how much gems they give to. They're such good money, man. Depends on which hunter you're talking about. 65. Oh, there goes my frame rate. What just happened? What are the turkeys doing? Oh no. I broke classic. I don't know what just happened, man. Of course they would do this on a 65, man. I can't move my mouse even. This is so bad. What's happening? I saw those turkeys like flipping around. I feel like that might have something to do with it. Why did it have to do something like this on a big turkey? Why couldn't it have done it on one of the smaller ones? We'll have to work with it. It's better than nothing, right? Oh gosh. Can we, can we get to it? I think we can get it. Ah, there we go. Oh, now we're good? Of course. <laughs> Oh, man. The turkey's in the back are vibing. Uh, something. I don't know if I'd call it vibing, but, uh, they're doing something. Something weird. Please don't bug out this time. 
8.8, 56. That's still a solid one. This was a really good group of turkeys. Glitched props. I know, right? It would be nice to have captions. 57. That was really good. Two fifth. Every single turkey in that group of four was 55 plus. Or I think at least. Yeah, 56, 57. Um, 65. And then the other was like what? The 60. What was the other one? Like 63? All right, everybody. We are now in the trophy lodge. And... This is that little piebald dough that we got. Now, I didn't really have anything else to mount, so... Yeah, this is about the only thing that I mounted from those highlights, because pretty much everything else I had something that was a little bit better. Obviously, the white tail, we have our 194. And then, I'd like to get a better turkey before I mount one of those, so... Yeah, but I figured I'd show off this lodge a little bit. We just recently purchased this lodge, so... That's pretty awesome. Been doing quite a bit of missions to get gems, and I figured a new trophy lodge would probably be a good buy because we didn't actually have this particular style of lodge yet, so definitely pretty awesome, but let's go ahead and go over these real quickly since I have had a few requests to uh, show off my lodges, so some of these animals are filler ones that will eventually get moved, but for the most part, we got some decent trophies in here. We got a 52 coyote, a uh, 1243 Gadwall, a 586 Rock Ptarmigan, we got a 1498 Black Duck, we got a 1479 Mallard. Uh, if I remember right, these Grizzlies are just filler, but we've got a non-typical 98 scoring Whitetail, we got our 194 Whitetail, we have a 101 non-typical Whitetail, uh, a 323 non-typical Mule Deer, 345, uh, this guy actually needs to get moved. I forgot I've actually got my better one in my other lodge, so I guess we're gonna have to change that out, but here's a 110 Sitka Deer. This thing almost hit leaderboards. It was like 0.1 off, I believe, which is crazy. Uh, this is a 157 Bantang, by far the biggest one I've ever killed, and I believe at one point when I actually killed this, it was like position 13 on the leaderboards, if I remember correctly. And then right here is a Melanistic Bantang, which I don't really see too many of these get posted or anything like that, so I'm assuming they're pretty rare, most likely. Right here we got a piebald red deer, a 267.8 red deer, a melanistic red deer. This is probably one of my favorite things, because as most of you know, this is something I really want to get in Call of the Wild, and we just have not been lucky enough, unfortunately, but here in the Hunter Classic, I do have a melanistic red deer bull, or stag, so that's pretty sweet. We got a piebald roe deer right here. Uh, here is an albino mule deer doe. You guys actually saw this one in a recent video. We got a 263 water buffalo, another filler grizzly bear. And here is a little red fox with the gray variation. I thought that would look pretty cool, so I decided to put him in here. Now, one thing I didn't notice about this lodge that I found out recently was that it's actually got a ton of spots to put birds, so... We're gonna have to do some waterfowl hunting or something in the near future and get some of those filled up. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It really does help the channel out a ton. We recently hit 4,000 subscribers and honestly, I can't thank you guys enough. It's been an awesome, awesome journey. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit that like button and I will see you all in the next one. Peace. If you are new here and you are liking what you see, consider subscribing to the channel and turning notifications on. Also, if you want to help the channel grow, be sure to like the video because this alone can help the video and my channel do better. But that's going to be it for me. Peace, my dudes. I hope you all have a fantastic day.